Right guys, I'm at a very uh, exclusive pin. It's a bus graveyard and I'm just going to see if I can get in and have a look round. There doesn't seem to be anybody here. So I'm going to go and have a look around and see. First of all, I'm just going to check there's nobody about. graveyard um, not many urbexes have done this so I'm just gonna have a quick look round this was a double-decker bus by the looks of it it's pretty cold isn't it somewhere along here there's some fire engines but we'll, we'll find them eventually there's a steering wheel let's go up the stairs have a look up the stairs guys ah oh, it's been blocked off but I'll, I'll put that over so you can see that's been blocked off okay no no worry there's still plenty of other buses to cook into it's a Sunday morning so I'm hoping there's no fuckers about Of the bus graveyards up there. Caravan. Not that we're here to see caravans. graveyard isn't it eh? so let's go and have a look down here they all look pretty beat up it's a coach down here so we're going to have a look at this coach Days this one. Nice luxurious coach. Driving seat. There's a lot of vehicles here, so we'll get down quick. So we're in Ireland, and uh, this is a famous uh, bus graveyard, which only a few urbexes have been to. I'm not going to climb in every bus, but you can get the gist of it, what it looks like. I'm going to be quiet because, uh, I'm going to be quiet because I don't know if it's here or not. Hopefully not. Pretty old buses as well. Pretty old buses. It's a Sunday, so I'm hoping because it's a hoping because it's a Sunday. There's nobody about. The other bus. Make sure coaches and buses. Tom Killer Travel. So, uh, yeah, this is the bottom bit of the bus yard. So, uh, have a look around, guys.
fantastic in it all these buses been put out of action so originally this was a bus museum originally this was a bus museum and um it just went to pot basically Is here, look. Used to be a lot, lot more, but unfortunately, they've gradually started to scrap them. I don't know if the gypsies own this place or what. I'm going to be careful here because I don't know if there's anybody on site or not. It's a Sunday, and I'm hoping there's nobody on site. Took a bit of a walk to get here. Nonetheless, we're here. There's the front gates. Now, there should be some fire engines about somewhere, but I think they've been taken out. Oh, there we go, here's the fire engines. It's a lucky day, guys. A lucky day. Gates are closed, so there's nobody about. That's good, that's even better. Let's go and have a look at the fire engines, guys. So this is in the fire engine. This is a cab. The older firefighters used to stay on the way to emergencies. Let's see if this opens. No, maybe there. Let's see if this opens. Oh, it opens. Oh, it opens. Good, good, good. So this is a cab. Look. There's the crest. Fire Brigade 999. Can't, I can't even speak, pronounce this, but it's Irish. I'll show Irish here, let's see if you know what it means. So we just have a look right down here. More fire engines. where they used to keep all the hoses in fact there's a hose there oh there's a hose there look another hose over there let's climb up this thing this is a ladder let's get up this ladder guys have a look at the top Ooh. So we've got the top of all the fire engines as one, one, two, three, four, five fire engines. Beautiful. Now I'm 
still creeping around because although the gates are closed I've got to make sure there's nobody about again this is where all the firefighters used to sit in here the cab it's fucking roof's rusted a bit though lads isn't it roof's rusted a bit there's the cab there we are so we move along move along Take a picture of all the all the things together. There's a yellow fire engine there. Yellow fire engine there. Beautiful boys, beautiful. Just checking there's nobody about. The gates are closed, so there's nobody here. It's a right fucking rust bucket of the place this is. So it seems to be a place for the coaches and older fire engines. Let's see if this is this, 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 this. opens. I'm not gonna get in the cab because it's all shitty. And I've actually got my nice clothes on. So I don't really want to get in a cab. <coughs> Stealth is a word with these sort of jobs, love. Stealth is a word. So again, that's where they stored all the oh, yeah, bolt cutters, De dewalt saw, bolt cutters, barrier tape gloves. Maximum load 45 kilograms, shackles, salvage sheet. So all this stuff was here. Hydraulic hose, foam, branch axes, chocks, blocks, cones, bra branches. Yeah. All here anyway. So we'll make our way along. This is a yellow one, so I've never seen yellow fire engine before, they're usually red. Again, there's the uh, crew's sitting quarters when on the way to an emergency. That fucking door's falling off by the looks of it. There we go. There's the old uh, cab again. front of urbex this so that's all the fire engines together one two three four five six seven I can count seven we move back onto the buses fill the tires so maybe we can get in them I think fill the tires this one's had a crash by looks of it with our vandals there. Red Fania or something. Two, two the little one that one, yeah. Two the little one that. Let's see if we can get in it. That's a two the little bus, this one, guys. So it's taken me a bit of effort to clamber through forests um, and uh, fields to get here, but I'm glad I got here. Like I said, not many airbags, not many airbexes. One game that one because it's got my favourite in it, brambles. Not many airbexes have been here. So I'm quite happy I've got in. Quite easy to get in actually, just walk in. To every bus because uh, it seems pointless. You get the gist of it. 
That one's full of tyres. Now, do I go straight up to the main gates and be brazen enough to go up to the main gates? Or do I not? Nobody here, so it's good. That's good. Very peaceful as well here. Lovely and peaceful. There's the cab again. Nature's really taken over this. What we do is we do a couple of, couple of pictures, lads. Seems polite to. Cut little pictures. So what I'm going to do is take some pictures. Take pictures as we go along. Let's. I don't think let's go up to the gate it's a bit blazing and go up to the gate you know you want to I want to you want to everybody wants to oh, we've got a panicky bird there okay so we we'll keep out of sight let's go over this way let's have a look at these ones lovers all sorts of all sorts of bikes here. Bikes, sorry, not bikes, buses, all sorts of buses here. Cat here as well, little cat. Oh, look at that. This is open. No, don't open. I made that into a storeroom. Look, how weird. Little seat, little storeroom. Just seen a wild cat just run dart under the bus. Hilarious. Juicy, juicy, juicy. This is what makes urbexing fun. Doing all this. I don't want to go too close to the gates just in case somebody walks past. Thing. Oh, it's 
Is it fair to us? What one photo? Sorry if I'm holding the camera dodgy, but I, I want to take photos, guys. You know what I mean? You've got to take photos, you've got to take photos. Fans, please present, present your ticket or pay cash. Exact money, speed, service, your service. Child fares over four uh, under 16 years. Again, they've put tyres in here to stop people canalering in. So yeah, pretty cool guys, pretty cool. So what I'm gonna do is skedaddle out of here in a minute. Because I think we've seen everything we need to see. Just taking photos here guys, so bear with me. Photos here. So I'll have just a quick look down here again, and then we'll be on our way. Don't know if I can get out of the gate or not. What do you reckon, guys? Okay. Mm -hmm. Not sure. Beautiful, isn't it? Beautiful. So there's not a lot I can say really, just look, watch, look, and uh, Love really, basically. See if I can get see if I can get out up here. I think. See if there's an easy way in and out. Don't think there is, but we'll see. just left these buses here like this so it used to be as I understand it a bus museum in Ireland and then I don't know what happened with the owner but it all went I'll oh, say the tit lovers and then they've just been left here to rot but, but apparently a lot of buses have actually been scrapped so uh, yeah This could be brazen and go up to the, the gate. Let's see if there's actually a way in through the gate. This wasn't going to clamber. Clamber, clamber, clamber. So that's it, Irish bus graveyard. Hope you enjoyed. I filmed a bit going back. Just got to work out how to get out of here. Can we get through here? Let's see if we can get through here. Don't know if I'm slim enough. There we are. 
can. And I can't. It's the way I come in. But it's the way I'm going out. Not the way I come in. It's not the way I come in, but it's the way I'm going out. Let's get out of here, lads. Let's hope I don't get me. Don't meet the farmer on the way. Choices, which is the best way to go? Let's go through here, I think, rather than that. Through there, it's the best way to go through here. So I've got a long way back to walk to Irish Urbexa. Um, and uh, it's basically going through fields, through forests, you name it. It's more hard, that was more hard than actually getting into the bus graveyard, guys. Yeah, you wouldn't believe it, but it is. So, uh, we'll get back, and then we're going to get some food, me and Irish Herbex, and then uh, until the next pin. So, uh, I love you and leave you. That is it for now.